Welcome to the Columbus Community Hospital Pulmonary Function Lab. These tests are also referred to as PFTs or breathing tests. They are done to measure how well your lungs take in and exhale air. They also measure how well your lungs transfer the oxygen from the lungs to the bloodstream. Depending on your doctor's orders, you may be doing up to four different types of tests today. This is the machine that we use to perform your PFTs. It may appear to be a confined space. So if you have any problems with claustrophobia, please let us know and we will work with you. You will be asked to wear nose clips and place your lips around the mouthpiece forming a tight seal at the start of each test. Spirometry is the measurement of the amount of air you can move during a single deep breath and the speed at which you can exhale the air. In this test, you will start out with your nose clips on and your mouth around the mouthpiece. You will be asked to take a few normal breaths on the mouthpiece before taking a big deep breath. Once that deep breath is in, you will immediately blast your air out all the way until you are instructed to take a deep breath back in. This test may be repeated three or more times to make sure we have your best efforts recorded. Maximum voluntary ventilation, also known as MVV, is the measurement of the muscular strength in your lungs. In this test, you will start with your nose clips on and your mouth around the mouthpiece. You will be asked to take a few normal breaths on the mouthpiece and when prompted, you will breathe deep and fast for 12 seconds. This test may be repeated three or more times to make sure we have your best efforts recorded. Diffusion Capacity Testing, DLCO. This test estimates how efficiently your lungs transfer oxygen to your bloodstream. This test could also require a blood test. You will start out with your nose clips on and your mouth around the mouthpiece. You will be asked to take a few normal breaths on the mouthpiece. Then you will need to slowly and completely exhale all of the air from your lungs. After that, you'll be instructed to take a steady deep breath in and hold that breath. Keep holding until you are asked to completely exhale all your air again. This test may be done at least two times, but no more than five. Lung volume measurements. This is a two-part test that measures your absolute lung volumes or your total lung capacity along with a residual volume or the volume of air that remains in your lungs after you exhale fully. This is the only test that requires the door closed on the testing box. It will only be closed for about five minutes and you will always have the ability to open the door if you need to. Part one of the test starts with you sitting inside the box with the door closed for one minute prior to starting. This gives the inside temperature of the box the opportunity to adjust to your body temperature. We will instruct you to put on the nose clips and seal your lips around the mouthpiece. Make sure you are sitting up straight with your feet flat on the floor and your hands on your cheeks. Once you are set, we do not want you to move in the box. The only movement we want to see is your chest moving from breathing. You will begin with normal breathing followed by shallow panting. As you are panting, you will feel as if the mouthpiece has become blocked. Keep panting until instructed to go back to normal breathing. You will be asked to do this at least two more times. The second part of the test can be done with the door open. You will start with the nose clips and your mouth around the mouthpiece. You will be asked to take a few normal breaths on the mouthpiece and then slowly exhale all of your air. You will then take in a slow, deep breath and exhale it back out again. You will be asked to do this at least two more times. Following your test, we will be unable to give out any results. Please contact your ordering physician's office to get your test results.